Jesus is King. Welcome once again to a father's bookshelf. My name is Timothy Flanders. I'm the founder of Meaning of Catholic, and this is an offering to our Mary Queen of the Home domestic church group. This is part of our guild community where we talk all about domestic church, building that domestic church. If you want to support us, you can go to meaningofcatholic.com slash register. You can join the guild community. You can join that domestic church group, and you can talk about these things. Talk about Catholic parenthood. This is the thing that we should be talking about most of all on the internet, uh, but we're concerned more with drama and whatnot. But that's that's why we're trying to offer these sorts of things. So today's, today's uh, book, a wonderful book, How the Angels Got Their Wings. Uh, our Lord says a very mysterious and powerful saying in the gospel. He says that, Woe to you who give scandal to these little ones because their angels always see the face of my Heavenly Father. And so we know that the angels are very close to little children. They love little children just as God loves little children. And so this is a wonderful book to read to your children because uh, not only do angels love children, but children love angels. And so it's a wonderful, wonderful book to introduce the dogma of angels to our children. All right, so here's the book, How the Angels Got Their Wings. And it's a really great book because it, it shows this, this reality that children can often see that we can't. Um, I love how it, it brings out the, the sky because this is always traditionally understood to be the angels moving the planets. Uh, we also have the, the epic battle here. Kids love that. Um, and this is really a, this is a really great illustration because it's got the devil here and the, and the guardian angel because that's the, that's the reality of the spiritual life. And um, so it goes through all the different, uh, this is the reality of what's going on, these, these angels. Uh, so I really love, I think what the greatest strength of this book is these fantastic illustrations. Um, and we have also, of course, the Holy Sacrifice. Unfortunately, it's, it's facing the wrong way, but that's okay. At least it has uh, this reality, because this is also the way that um, the, the, the Blessed Sacrament is shown to the people, of course. Um, but we have just really glorious illustrations of this book, and so I really love the illustrations that really bring up the, um, the spiritual reality of the angels. Oh, uh -huh. 